Have we found an Earth-like planet? Is there another world out there that could potentially harbor life as we know it? The quest to answer these questions has captivated the human mind for centuries. This fascination is rooted in our innate curiosity and our desire to understand what lies beyond the familiar. We've always been explorers, adventurers, seekers of the unknown. The vast expanse of space with its myriad of stars and galaxies has always beckoned us, whispering the promise of discovery and the potential for new beginnings. Our journey into the cosmos began with a single small step, the launch of the first artificial satellite, Sputnik, in the late 1950s. This event marked the dawn of the space age, an era defined by rapid advancements in technology and a collective desire to explore the universe. As our understanding of the cosmos grew, so did our curiosity. We began to wonder, are there other worlds out there just like ours? Could there be other Earths, perhaps even teeming with life? This led to the birth of exoplanet research, the scientific pursuit of planets outside our solar system. In the early days of this quest, the technology was still catching up to our ambitions. But even so, we made some remarkable discoveries. In the mid-90s, we discovered the first exoplanet orbiting a sun-like star, a gas giant akin to Jupiter rather than Earth. This was a significant milestone, proving that planets could exist beyond our own solar system. But our ultimate goal has always been to find an Earth-like planet, a world with similar conditions to our own where life as we know it could potentially exist. Over the years, we've found numerous exoplanets, some in the habitable zone of their star, where conditions might be just right for liquid water, a key ingredient for life as we know it, to exist. But the question remains, have we found a planet that is truly like Earth? Let's delve into this intriguing question. The hunt for an Earth-like planet is not as simple as it seems. It's a game of cosmic hide-and-seek, a needle in a galactic haystack, if you will. There are numerous challenges that scientists face in their quest, the first one being distance. These planets are light years away from us, making it extremely difficult to observe them directly. Then there's the issue of brightness. Stars, around which these planets orbit, outshine them by a factor of a billion, making these planets seem like mere specks in the vast cosmos. And let's not forget about the size. Earth-like planets are relatively small, making them even harder to spot. Nevertheless, our scientists are not deterred. They employ sophisticated tools and techniques in their search. The Kepler Space Telescope, for instance, has been a game-changer. It doesn't look for planets directly. Instead, it watches for the tiny dimming of a star's light as a planet passes in front of it, a method known as the transit method. Then there's the TESS mission, short for Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite. TESS scans the skies, looking for tiny dips in the light of stars, potentially indicating the presence of a planet. But what exactly qualifies a planet to be considered Earth-like? There are a few key criteria. Firstly, the planet must be in the habitable zone of its star, also known as the Goldilocks zone, where conditions are just right, not too hot, not too cold, for liquid water to exist on the surface. Then, it should be of roughly similar size to Earth and have a rocky composition. The hunt is not just about finding a planet, but finding a planet that could potentially support life. This isn't about finding a new home, but about understanding our place in the cosmos and perhaps finding other life forms. And after years of relentless search, have we hit the jackpot? Do we have a winner in the cosmic lottery? Ladies and gentlemen, we have indeed found an Earth-like planet. Cue the excitement and wonder as we delve into the details of this extraordinary discovery. Nestled within the habitable zone of its star, our celestial neighbor lies a staggering four and a half light years away from us. This is a distance so vast that our current technology would take around 70,000 years to reach it. Yet, it feels so close when we consider the infinite expanse of the cosmos. This newfound world orbits a red dwarf star, affectionately known as Proxima Centauri, the closest star to our solar system. Unlike our sun, Proxima Centauri is smaller and cooler. But don't let that fool you. The planet orbiting it, named Proxima Centauri b, is just a smidge larger than our home, Earth. This similarity in size is one of the crucial factors that make this world so intriguing and Earth-like. Now let's venture into the realm of this planet's potential habitability. Proxima Centauri b resides in the Goldilocks zone, a region not too hot, not too cold, but just right for the existence of liquid water, an essential ingredient for life as we know it. 
However, it's worth noting that being in the habitable zone doesn't guarantee the presence of life. It merely indicates the possibility. The conditions of this new world are fascinatingly Earth-like. The temperature range, the presence of an atmosphere, and the potential for water all point towards a world that could, in theory, harbor life. However, before we get our hopes up, we must remember that these are preliminary findings. More research, more exploration, and more understanding are needed to truly determine the livability of this newfound exoplanet. This remarkable discovery has opened a new chapter in our quest for finding life beyond Earth. Let this be a reminder, a beacon of hope, that we are not alone in this vast, infinite universe. The discovery of Proxima Centauri b is not just a step, but a giant leap in our cosmic journey. So, what's next in our cosmic journey? Our discovery of an Earth-like planet has opened a new chapter in the grand epic of space exploration. The next steps will be both challenging and exhilarating, as we strive to deepen our understanding of this distant world, the future of space exploration will now more than ever focus on this Earth-like planet. Our space agencies are already brainstorming, designing, and strategizing missions to get a closer look at our newfound cosmic neighbor. As we speak, probes are being engineered to withstand the journey through the vast expanse of space to land on this alien world and send back invaluable data. These unmanned missions will be our eyes and ears helping us to understand the planet's environment, geology, and perhaps even its weather patterns. But probes aren't the only tools in our arsenal. Powerful telescopes, both terrestrial and orbital, are being reoriented to keep a constant watch on this planet. These silent sentinels will observe the planet's movements, study its atmosphere, and search for signs of seasonal changes. Every bit of data will bring us closer to answering the burning question. Is this planet capable of supporting life as we know it? And then the ultimate endeavor, human missions. As ambitious as it sounds, plans are already being sketched out for the day when humans will set foot on this Earth-like planet. This won't be a small step for a man, but a giant leap for mankind, marking our first tangible reach beyond the confines of our solar system. But what if we find life there? The implications would be profound reshaping our understanding of life's place in the cosmos. It would mean we are not alone, and that life, in one form or another, can flourish in the farthest corners of the universe. As we stand on the brink of this new era, the discovery of an Earth-like planet is just the beginning. So, to answer the question, yes, we have found an Earth-like planet. This discovery is a milestone in our celestial journey, marking a significant leap forward in our quest to find potential life beyond Earth. The planet, a distant world nestled in a far-off solar system, has striking similarities with our home planet. It has a temperate climate, a rocky terrain, and most importantly, it lies within the habitable zone of its star, just like Earth. This find has not only broadened our horizons but has also reaffirmed our belief in the existence of other Earth-like planets. It's a testament to human ingenuity, underscoring our ability to reach beyond our own solar system and unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. This is but a single page in the grand tome of space exploration, a tale that is still being written.